If you spend anywhere as much time as me on Zoom, Microsoft Teams, Google Meets, uh, then you will have encountered someone using a meeting bot. Maybe it's uh, otter.ai. And what a meeting bot allows them to do is to get a transcription and a recording of the meeting and then all sorts of cool AI features um, like summaries, yeah, transcription, um, action points, you know, AI just means you can take a transcript and you can do amazing things with the data provided in it. Now, if you ever thought about, uh, well, maybe I can build one of these, uh, you know, there's all sorts of industries that uh, now, since the pandemic, since COVID, we've, we're using video calls uh, so much more and they've become a much more acceptable way to meet. Uh, and you might be wondering, well, I've got an idea for one, but how would I go about building it? Well, here's a service that I've been recommended and it's called uh, Recall AI and it is the universal API for meeting bots. And if you've uh, followed this channel, if you subscribed, if you haven't, please do, uh, then you'll know that we can build amazing apps with Bubble.io, which is a no-code web application platform, and we can extend the uh, potential of Bubble by integrating in with third-party APIs. And that is just basically the way that two different servers or services or software communicate with each other. And so what you can do with Recall is that you can you can take notes, uh, you can have it analyze the conversation, uh, you can basically do anything that you see other meeting bots doing. And you can do it all through the API. Uh, it looks like, yeah, Zoom, Google Meets, Microsoft Teams, they've got Slack huddles as a beta, just some real cool potential of what you can do here, Look, even HIPAA compliant. Um, so yeah, if you are interested in building a meeting bot application, you maybe want to do your own thing with the meeting data. Uh, like for example, an idea I had uh, recently is uh, using like live transcription, no matter how talented, like a sales call or even something like therapy, although obviously be careful with the privacy side of that and the consent side. But what if the uh, the transcription in combination with an AI, again, privacy, consent, all very important, but if that all worked together, if that was all possible, you could have a meeting bot that um, provided prompts uh, to the professional who's guiding the conversation. You know, even if you've got years of experience, the uh, information that an AI can draw upon, you could even, you know, feed it with PDFs of the particular type of practice that you take part in uh, and it can just suggest well this is where the conversation goes it can pick up on things that maybe you haven't picked up on uh, before because we're all human we all overlook things but the transcription combined with the AI could do amazing things uh, I'm going to sign up for a demo uh, because I'd really love to give this uh, application a, uh, a, a try um, and uh, yeah, please leave a comment below if you've got any ideas of how you could use a meeting bot to do something uh, really cool. Uh, and if you're learning Bubble, uh, then click the link down below also because we've got hundreds of Bob tutorial videos. Um, not quite like this one. This is more just highlighting a service because that seems to be quite uh, useful content. I do like to highlight um, cool con to cool services that come my way. Um, but you know, my main thing here, my main stick is to uh, teach people how to build no code apps using Bubble.io. So click that link down there to get access to hundreds of videos of our content.